Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Terra Firmacraft with myself, Lewis. I hope you're all very good and very well. I'm just going to have a quick sip. There we go. Feeling good. And we're going to carry on from where we left off last time. I have not done anything since then. I had a problem with my TFC launcher and I've been a little bit busy with the 12 hour live stream that we did. So we are back though and we're going to uh, crack on and get some awesome stuff done. I'm thinking I'm going to finish up my floor today and maybe uh, hopefully get some stuff from our sluices. And I might even kind of make this area look a little bit nicer because at the minute there isn't really too much going on. Our sluices haven't got much in them so I probably need to <clears throat> fill these guys up at some point. So let's go ahead and do that. And we need to get loads of gravel, and I keep forgetting what gravel looks like for some reason. Uh, I find it very hard to find gravel. I think it might be this. I don't know. Let's go grab some of our uh, pans, and we can at least get some of our pans on the go. Maybe it's this. I don't know. Let's have a look. Is this gravel? This is dirt. Maybe not. All right. Fair enough. All right. We'll grab, we'll grab some pans. Hmm. What do I do with my pans? <laughs> Where are my pans? Oh, they might actually be up here. All right, we'll grab some of my pans. There we go. And we'll fill some of these up and put it back in our saluces. There we go. Very nice. Oh, some of you. Some of you. Oh, I don't want to do that. I want to pick it up. There we go. Get inside my pan. My gold pan. There we go. All right. You can go in there like that. Fill yourself up, do all your things. There we go. We'll take a little bit more just for over here as well. There we go, for the other side, so he can be happy as well. And then uh, we'll crack on getting some things sorted. We've got a bit of mystery dirt there that I put there that I don't think gets sucked in. <laughs> there we go. Brilliant. All right, so let's finally crack on, get this house finished up, and uh, then we can uh, move on with some, with some other things. I do want to get a, a bit of fishing on the go as well, so maybe we can do some of that. And I need to get a nice area for all of our fireplaces and everything. So that's pretty much what's next on the uh, on on the agenda on the old list. But I need to find out more of these trees that gave us the red stuff because I can't actually remember what ones they were. And I know it's some of these around here, but I got to figure out which one gave us all the good stuff. So it might be this one. Let's find out, shall we? This is probably going to go ahead and like blow my axe up, but it'll be all right. It'll be fine. So this one is white elm. All right, so we don't want white elm. We want the red one. Um, well, let's see if we can find it. If not, I might have to actually vastly rethink my flooring plans, and uh, that will completely ruin my Feng Shui. So uh, I, I really don't want to go messing up my Feng Shui too much, my Gen Gui. Um, let's try and let's try and not have that happen. Oh, this looks red. Maybe it's this stuff. Yeah, this looks pretty red, I guess. Let's see if this does the trick. This one's definitely going to go ahead and blow up my axe. <laughs> Oh, we're right next to sand as well, so I could probably grab some sand while we're here. Get all the gems for the ladies. Oh, did that really destroy my... Oh, we got another bit of axe. All right, so this is... Uh, ash, maybe? Is it ash? Let's see what ash turns into. Ah, yeah, ash. So I think ash is what we want, which is this guy. So let's grab as much ash as we can we should be able to take the whole tree down it's probably going to decimate my axe but that's all right because we can make many more axes uh we're good at making axes <laughs> we've got pretty good at making axes all right so let's grab all this lovely lovely elm there we go or ash lovely lovely ash there we go brilliant and there should be maybe a little more hiding away somewhere nope that's all right we got tons of the stuff so, we'll take you, and I broke my ting. All right, we can probably make some more. Yeah, of course we can, there we go. I have to concentrate so bad when we do this. <laughs> there we go, all right, there's one, and uh, we've only got enough for one, so that would, actually, no, we can make two, can't we? All right, we'll, we'll do two, just to get it out of the way so we don't have to do it later on, and I did a bad. All right, let's try again. Oh, I can't now, come on. There we go. All right, come on. Gods of Terra Firma Craft be in my favour today. There we go. Alright, so we'll put you there. We'll make that. We'll make a uh, an axe. 
probably the best axe you're ever going to see. So we'll turn the rest of this ash into planks and all of these guys like this. There we go. So that gives us a decent amount and then we should be able to change these into these guys. Yeah, those are the ones. We're going to need a fair amount, so but at least I know what it actually looks like now, which is always the first first thing is understanding your surroundings if you're uh, if you're quite the naturalist, which I am. So uh, I think we're looking pretty good and if we found any more then it's not really too much of a problem because uh, we can cut it down because we have we have the resources and I'm gonna grab you guys as well there we go so we're gonna take some of this as well some sand so we can feed it into our into our sluices so we can get all of the all of the gems and stuff someone actually replied to the video saying that they're useless and they probably are but they're gonna have a future use so I feel that maybe getting some of them is a good idea um, let's just try this. I need to find out what gravel is. I cannot for the life of me remember what gravel looks like. It all just looks the same to me. Are these... Ha! Oh, have we just found carrots? Are those... Oh! We found carrots. Lovely. I'm gonna turn those. Very nice. Wow. Now we can have carrots with our meat. Mm. Hello, Mr. Cow. Okay, right, let's get back and uh, we'll try and get a roof on this place and maybe try and finish a few bits and bobs off. I'm thinking that we need to we need to do the floor, we need to do the roof, and we need to fix up the sluice area, the the sluicy majusy. We need to do that so we can get all of the uh, all of the good stuff happening. And uh, let's just check and see if we've got any stuff here now since we've been since we've been gone. Nope. And no, oh, all right. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw some sand in there. I know I'm not supposed to because it won't give me much, but hell, it'll be all right. So we'll throw a bit of sand in these guys, and hopefully they'll give us some good stuff. Maybe some more rubies or uh, armaments or whatever they're called. Yeah, a few of those guys. And I do want to make another chest at some point as well. Have we got enough things to make a chest? Can you double up planks to make chests? I don't know. Let's find out. Let's do some mathematation. There we go. So we'll do that. And I don't think I have enough to do it mm, no let's just cut these guys up then all right we'll cut you up like this and get white elm oh oh I'm doing a fail there we go all right let's get back up and we'll try this one more time so we'll do you and make a uh, make the best chest known to uh, known to prehistoric man and we'll put you next to the other one and now we can at least get some uh, good stuff together there we go all right, so we can throw all our rubbish in here, except for our tools, because as we know, tools do not go in there in TFC. Oh, yeah. So uh, there we go. Right, now, let's dig this place up. Try and get a bit of flooring on the go. So at least that way it looks a little bit more natural. One thing I've noticed, which I'm not too sure with, is our terra firma craft days longer than regular Minecraft days, because it just feels like it's a little bit longer, you know? It feels like, oh, no. <laughs> it's a different type of wood. What type of wood is that? That is, well this is ash, so that must, I don't know. I have no idea. Help, help, help. <laughs> I'm gonna, oh my god, I'm gonna go to sleep. And uh, I can't even sleep, it's not even night time. What, what an epic disaster. All right, well we know what the other one looks like, don't we, the ash. So we can just go with ash. And uh, we, we'll dig the other one up in a minute and then carry on with that. We'll just put those aside and maybe they can be used as like an additional carpet or something. I don't know. Yeah, we'll do that. All right, let's get the rest of these guys out. We need to figure out how to do plants as well soon. Because I don't think you can just make a hoe. You need to make a hoe with a tip. Uh, just the tip on the hoe. And uh, then you can... Oh, crap. And then you can go ahead and you can start planting stuff. Now, I remember reading on the TFC wiki something about not being able to plant uh, certain things in certain places because the ground has to be uh, saturated or it has to be fertile, something like that. Um, so, yeah. Actually, I'm going to have a quick sleep. There we go. Yeah, it has to be fertile. So... We'll try and figure out how that works, uh, and maybe just try and do a bit of planting. But with my first bits of metal that we find, I really want to go ahead and uh, not use it for like stuff like that. All right, so we've got some spare bits. I'm gonna throw my dirt in there, my flowers. So we'll keep these guys on us because they're pretty useful, and uh, our cooked pork chops. There we go. And have we got enough stuff to make a wood? Because this is aspen. So we've got elm planks, ash planks. We've got willow planks. Let's um, 
this is white elm so this goes with this guy so i'm just trying to figure out what we've actually got here because this is i'm getting confused of all the woods so we've got willow which are these guys uh which which can go there uh, which is like that oh, i can't put them in there that's all right we'll put them next to it i guess so we'll put them here there we go and uh, we'll throw down our aspen as well there we go bam, bam, bam. there we go and all right so the roof is obviously the willow isn't it so the willow planks are these guys so we will need to go get more of those at some point but that's all right okay right i'm feeling a little bit happy that we're starting to get the floor done but we do need tons tons more of the um of the ash i believe of ash before we can actually go and do anything else but let's try and work on getting these sluices a bit more operational before we uh, before we kind of crack on with anything i think i w might want to lay down another sluice just one more next to this guy and uh, then we can uh, then we'll have three sluices on the go and we might have a bit better chance of being able to do all this i think that's a plan uh, and we do need to go around trying to find some uh, some more some more types of ores because relying on the sluices I don't think it's going to work. We're going to need a lot more ores. So I think going around smashing up rocks is probably going to be the way that we're going to have to do it. That's alright though. I don't mind. I am quite fond of smashing rocks. Uh, we've got some basalt rock. Nice. I remember hearing as well that you can do this I believe. Yeah and you get marble cobblestone. So maybe we could go around and change it up a little bit. Hmm. How many do we get for doing this? So four equals one. So we would need quite a bit. So maybe, actually no. I've Change of plans, change of plans. I don't want to go around doing the sluices because I feel like they're kind of a waste of time. Until there's more ladies in the prehistoric age, we don't really need the rubies and things. So we're going to do it as it is. And uh, and I want those pigs. <laughs> I need the pigs. Actually, we'll go get some, uh, we'll go grab some more sticks because we're going to need those very soon. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll take the pigs and then we'll go rock hunting. All right, there we go. So we got seven. So we'll make a load of these because I'm always running out of them. There we go. And I don't know if they auto replenish anymore. They might do. No, it doesn't look like they do. Maybe if we put them down here, they might do. I remember seeing somewhere that they like auto replenish if you keep them in the same place. Uh, nope, that didn't seem to do it. Okay, maybe it doesn't anymore. But I am going to take your juicy meat. Oh, here we go. Long shot, long shot. Come at me, boy. Come at me. There we go. Brilliant. All right, so we've got ourselves some more of this raw hide. And uh, we're going to figure out what we do with that soon. Apparently we have to get into tanning. And tanning is the first thing that we need to do to uh, start being able to make leather. And with leather we can then obviously go ahead and um, we can then make some armor. Which is like the road to success. Because armor is going to be uh, very helpful. We haven't really tried taking on any enemies yet. And uh, enemies in this are a lot harder. They are tons harder actually. A lot harder. And I don't want to go tango in with no creeper when I've got no armor. Because that is not going to work. All right, I think this one is Minecraft music. <laughs> I think. Wow, this is it's coming to like the guessing game. Oh, do we get an all? Hey, we got some foul right. All right. Yeah, let's just keep getting all these stones. Oh, mushroom. Yummy. There we go. I want to work on a nice place for all the fireplaces as well. Did we just get some more? We got six phalarite. Sweet. Oh, was that cast you? Oh no, more phalarite. So I'm going to place some dirt here. Oh, you can't tower it, can you? My bad. Can I place a mushroom on it? Nope. Um, I got an idea. There we go. So this is the land of Svalrite. And uh, this guy is their king. And uh, he's going to allow us to come back at some point and uh, make a allow us to remember that this is Svalrite king area. And that uh, we can come back and do some mining here and hopefully find some Svalrite. I'm not, I can't actually remember what Svalrite is. 
so we'll, uh, we'll soon find out when we start smelting it up. But we need quite a few bits of uh, sphalerite before we can actually turn it into an ingot. Yeah, we actually need quite a lot, so yeah, that's going to take a minute or two, but it's alright. It gives us time to explore the world. We've never really explored the world, so I guess we can now, and uh, we'll find all the cool things. And uh, I might even, before the end of this episode, go and grab myself those uh, those pumpkins that are up on the wall. <laughs> the ones that have been mocking me ever since we uh, came along to the, uh, to the sluice area. I'm actually getting a bit hungry. Yummy. Let's go have a dip as well because I'm getting a little bit thirsty. They say you should never drink seawater, but I seem to be quite fond of it, apparently. There we go. Lovely. If any of you ever use Twitter on an iPhone, because that's the noise I expect to hear when uh, when you go in the water. That, that kind of sound. That is the best sound. <laughs> I believe that is the sound the universe is going to make when it implodes on itself. It's going to go like that. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be a thing of beauty. Alright, so we're right next to the pumpkins. We're finally going to get these guys. I think now is a brilliant time. Let's let's harvest them and uh, maybe we'll get like, I don't know, some seeds or something? Some seeds? Yeah, I want some seeds. Some pumpkin seeds. Or maybe they'll just give us a whole pumpkin. Who knows? But I feel we have the tools to do it. Wow, they actually break really quickly. Can I turn these into seed packets? Yeah, I can turn them into pumpkin seeds. Alright. Nice! Alright! Yeah, I'll take all those. Ooh, that place looks pretty cool down there. <laughs> I hear that you're meant to look on the side of walls for certain types of rock. Like that rock along there. Who knows? Who knows? <laughs> Alright, let's. I'm gonna make my way back to the sluice area and then we'll crack on with getting some uh, bits and bobs done, I think. Alright, so I've finished cutting this guy down. I've left him a nice little kind of bit on top, just so uh, he doesn't get cold. <laughs> and uh, what we're going to do is, because I've had a think about things, and I've decided that firstly we're going to go get our, uh, we're going to get our crafting table and bring him inside, because I think he's cold. We're going to get him in, and then uh, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to make some racks to put on the outside of the house. Some hunting racks. And then we're going to make our way to the old house, because I remember having a lot of clay there. So I want to get a load of clay. We're going to pop you there. Yeah. I want to get all my clay. So that way we can start um, actually making some uh, some casts, I believe they're called. Might be casts or moulds. That's the one. Crafting moulds. Clay moulds. Yeah. We'll grab some of those. So I want to put these along here like this. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my javelins and throw them onto here. There we go. Beautiful. So that way, when people come past, they will see all of my uh, all of my javelins, and they'll be like, "Geez, I don't I don't want to mess with this bloke. He's got too many javelins." <laughs> they'll be like, "We've only got two, and he's got five. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna lose." Yeah, they would they would lose. All right, so let's get back home. It's like two hundred Minecraft meters away. It's been a long time since we've actually been back to our old house, and oh oh, is that a bit of terra firma craft music? That might be. I love how I get so excited about Terra Firma Craft music when I hear it. Even if it isn't Terra Firma Craft music, I still get excited. <laughs> so, so noobish. So noobish. I'm like a little child in a playground. Alright, so let's make our way back. We've got a hundred and something Minecraft meters or blocks. Can someone tell me what it is? Is that meters? Is that meters? I need to know because I'm pretty sure on every series I, I, I don't know what to call it. I'm like Minecraft meters. Blocks, blocks. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know. So tell me. Let me know. Wow, it's our old house. Oh, oh, beautiful. All right, let's take all this. Lovely jubbly. Oh, we've even got loads of wood in here. Nice. Uh, we should probably take this as well. I think we'll take everything so that way. Everything is uh, going to be moved to the new house. We'll even take our tanning barrel. There we go. Alrighty. So let's get back. And uh, now we can use... Wow, I've got my spindle. <laughs> I forgot we had a spindle. That's such a cool thing, a spindle. I'm actually getting a bit thirsty. Alright. I'm going to have a drink and then we'll be right back at the main house. It's a bit of a sprint. Alright, so we're back. I've got all my stuff here. It's looking good. So we're going to make some moulds. I think that's probably the first step. And then we can at least start trying to fill up some of the... Um, 
some of the rocks and bits and bobs that we've got melting it down. Now I do want to have a nice little area outside that is pretty smart and with like made of rocks and stuff. So I'm going to take my marble and I want to try first to make sure that we can set fireplaces up on on rock because I don't actually know if you can. So let's grab you. Come on, come off the wall. Oh, I can't grab it with that. There we go. And uh, we're going to dig a little area, I don't know, here. And we'll just pop him down and see if this works. So we'll put you there. And we'll throw some sticks on you. And oh, I don't want you there. I want you there. There we go. So we'll throw some sticks and use our... Oh, no. <laughs> fire starter. We'll try use our fire starter. There we go. Brilliant. All right, so it does work. Cool. All right, so now we've got this, we can go ahead and start putting all our molds in there and turning them straight into uh, proper molds but we do need to fill it with a bit of uh, gas so we've got medium wood medium wood medium medium apparently there's different types of woods and you can have uh, we don't want light uh, light medium there we go so those are the type of things we don't want we want medium medium so i guess we could use our cedar for the time being that'll probably work we haven't really got a use for cedar so we'll throw some of this gut in here there we go there's one plank Two plank, three plank, four. There we go. And this guy's going to get really hot and do his thing, and they will turn into an actual mold. So let's grab our rock as well. We're going to use some Svalrite and see if we can do this guy. Um, come on, you can do it. It does take a bit of time for them to do their thing. While it's doing that, we're going to uh, lay down some more rocks. I think, seeing as we we know we can do them, so we'll take we'll turn all these guys into the right things. There we go. So we got twelve. And there we go, that's one done. So let's do another one. And we're gonna dig, I don't know, we'll dig a nice little area around here. Kinda want it coming from my front step. Oh, that sounded different, didn't it, to dirt? What was that? Dirt, dirt. <laughs> it's all dirt. All right, there we go. And is this guy done? Not yet, okay. We'll place the rest of these down. So snazzy. There we go, brilliant. And we've got four more, so I guess we can fill this area out. You done? Nope. And you there? Cool, all right, so we're starting to get a little bit nicer now. <laughs> Things are happening. Yeah, there we go. So we'll put another fireplace here, I think. Ah, oh, I broke my fireplace, that's all right. Uh, we'll put another one there. Did it eat my, my mold? <laughs> I think it ate my mold. <laughs> That's not on. All right, there we go. We'll make another fire starter. See if we can get another one of these guys down here. All right, there we go. Brilliant. All right, so we'll feed you some wood. I need to go get some more wood. Let's grab some more wood. There we go. We'll grab some more cedar and place this in there. Cool. There we go. And we're going to put... Oh, no. There we go. I've got my mold back. So we're going to put our mold down and we're going to put our spharrite in there and see if we can melt this spharrite into a liquid. So let's see what happens. Uh, I want to keep these nice and topped up so that way we're getting all the good stuff. Um, this guy is on warming. So he's getting there, but it takes a bit of time. I'm going to have a little bite to eat while it's doing that. All right. Is this mold done? There we go. There's that one. So we'll take you. So we've got another two molds. And I don't know if we can stack them. I don't think we can stack them. No, but we can do that. So that way, it's uh, it's all good. So he's on hot. He is on hot as well. Let's just go check our sluices, just in case they have managed to pull their finger out and actually do something decent. Nope, doesn't look like it. But while it's doing that, I guess I could do a bit of gold panning quickly, just to kind of uh, increase our stakes of actually getting some stuff. I think what I'm also going to do is I'm going to get a water source in my house. So that way, when I wake up in the morning, I can roll over and have a sip. There we go. I think this is a plan. Yeah, this is a plan. This is probably the best plan. There we go. And we'll place you just here. There we go. So when I get thirsty, I can just roll out of bed <laughs> into my little paddling pool and have a drink. Beautiful. Okay. So that's very hot. Ah, oh, there we go. We've got all our molds now. So now we just need to make sure that this other one stays warm. And it is getting a little bit dark outside. So let's just see if we can do this. Be interesting to see. Ah, zinc. There we go. So it's zinc. Oh, very nice. So I don't know if we've got enough. I think you need something like 15 to 20 bits. Or maybe, I remember reading somewhere about 24. I don't know. One of the two. But we do need a lot. 
and what I know is it's getting dark, so I'm probably going to go to bed. But it is looking quite nice. We've got all the cool things here. It's, look it's looking good. We've got a nice little rack outside. Looks really nice. I need some windows soon. Uh, we'll get some sand in these guys and get some glass, hopefully. And uh, we'll extend our pathway to glory. <laughs> Alright, you guys. I'll see you soon for another episode of Terra Firma Craft. Have a good one. And goodbye.